Hi guys, so today's video is going to be very different. It's not what I normally do, but this is going to be like a fun video that I've always sort of wanted to do. So today I'm going to be doing a YesStyle haul sort of because I bought some clothes from YesStyle quite a while back and you guys always compliment me on my clothes that I wear on stream. You guys tell me that it's like very cute and very pretty and some of you guys ask me where I get it from and most of my clothes I get from YesStyle. For those who don't know, YesStyle is an online store that sells Korean makeup, skincare and fashion and it's pretty well trusted because you can actually see the reviews that people have for the items that they buy. Because YesStyle sells mostly Korean stuff, it does have like that sort of K-pop-y vibe or just Korean aesthetics and makeup, skincare which is very up my alley. And so with all that being said, let's get into the video and start the haul. So the first item is this two-piece blouse, which I really like. I would say this is probably my favorite piece out of everything. The skirt is separate. The skirt I got from eBay. Um, it, it, it didn't really fit very well, so my mom had to fix the skirt, but this is a different item, not from YesL, so we're only gonna count the blouse. The blouse is very good quality. As you can see, it's very cutesy and it's very elegant. It's very girly, but it also has this off-the-shoulder vibe going on, which gives you like a sexy-ish vibe, but like not too sexy, not too revealing, which I like. Yeah, there's not really much else to say other than I really like it and it's very cute. So this is another mock tee piece that I got from YesStyle and I probably would normally um, style it with shorts, but this is actually not too bad with the skirt, it's pretty okay. I forgot to mention before that I wear a size 8 in Australia, which means I usually wear a size small or a extra small if they do have that option. Now I got this in the size small and it's I'm not too sure if it really fits properly because I can tell like this side of the shoulder is tugging a little bit. Now I know this is not supposed to be symmetrical because like the buttons do go sideways as it's intended, but this side you can see like on my collar part it's like sort of diagonal, like sort of tugging over here and this part is obviously not really like um, fitting properly so I'm not too sure if it's like intentional or maybe it's like a broad shoulders or something but yeah I got a size small I think it looks fine anyways like it's not too big of a deal but um, it doesn't fit perfectly but I think it still looks cute in terms of quality I think it's pretty good even though this shirt doesn't fit perfectly I still really like it it gives me this very cutesy vibe going on with the shoulder action and all and you know it's still very everyday I think it's very cute and pretty even though it doesn't fit perfectly what do you guys think? I think by now you guys can tell that there's a bit of a pattern going on with me and this like sort of off the shoulder look. I really like this sort of off the shoulder look because it's like, you know, it gives this very cutesy vibe but still sexy. Um, now this was around $35 and it actually is really good quality. Like it's really soft and I think it's really pretty. It's really cute. Now I really do like this a lot but the only problem I have with it is that I do have like body acne and so it does show through and which is why I don't really wear this too often just because I'm a little insecure with my body acne but if I didn't have any of it like I would wear this quite a lot I mean it's not really even too bad so I probably should wear this more it's you know it's really soft it's really nice I really like it a lot I'd say this is like my second favorite piece out of everything and if it were for like my insecurities I would probably um, have this my favorite piece out of everything because I think it's just so cute and pretty now in terms of length it is quite short um, I'm around 5'6", and if you're wondering also my weight, I weigh around 40-ish kilograms, or like 45 maybe, which is around like 90 to 100 um, pounds, but yeah, in terms of length, it is quite short, I know that if I like raise my arm, you guys are gonna like see downstairs, so yeah, um, if you are wanting something longer, maybe try like a size up. Actually, never mind, I just saw this and it's actually uh, one size only. Um, so if you're worried about the length, uh, yeah, this might not be for you, but you know, I don't really mind being a little bit scandalous to be quite honest, so I, personally I don't really mind, but yeah, if you're worried about the length, this is um, probably not for you. So this is a mini hoodie dress, and you guys can see that there's like an inbuilt corset um, moment going on in here, which I really like, it gives you like that cinched in waist. I like this a lot because it gives you this casual vibe but also like a sexy cute look because it is like a 
sort of like a mini skirt and all in terms of quality it is quite thin so like on a cold day it's not enough to keep you warm and a hot day it's not going to really overheat you now for me personally i'm very skinny and when i mean skinny i don't mean like mariah carey skinny i mean like malnourished type of skinny like anorexic underweight skinny and so i get cold quite easily and usually this is not enough on a cold day sometimes i wear this when i stream or if it's a warm day and i'm going outside um i wore this in my pax vlog when i was doing the just dancing so you guys would have seen this um already it's not my first time wearing it i, I think it's really cute i really like it i like this corset moment cinched in ways and yeah. So I got this belt for like $4 and by the way guys, the Yes Style store always has like these sales that are like $20 belt that is on 80% sale. That's like just like a marketing thing that like all these like online stores of fast fashion, they always do that. So it's like, um, they're always going to be on sale. Don't feel like you're going to miss out. They're always going to be on that um, sale. So anyways, so I got this belt and I really like it. I just wanted something that was... Uh, like an accessory or whatever that would like bump up anything that was basic. So I had this um, shirt which is just like uh, a long shirt that would be, be normally very plain and boring by itself but this sort of belt like really I guess elevated to look like a dress and you know get give that um, waist um, cinched in moment and yeah mm -hmm. the only problem I have with this belt is just that like um, it sort of has like the flappy moment going on and you can like tuck it in but it's like very loose so it like still like moves around as you guys can see that's the only problem i have with it but other than that it does give me like this sort of k-pop vibe which i really like so i actually have three pieces in here i have the, sh the top the corset and the pants if you guys know luna the music video butterfly you would probably see a resemblance or at least a similarity in the sort of butterfly um, vibe going on. I did wear this at PAX, so if you did watch my PAX video, you would have seen that I wore this when I was doing the Just Dance um, vlog. I started with the top, now with the top it's like pretty thin and it's not like completely see-through but you can see a little bit depending on like the lighting and all. Um, the ruffles, at first I really hated because it's like, you know, it's just like, it was, it was a bit much and in the picture I didn't think it was like this much sort of roughly moment and I thought it would look a bit silly but now I'm going to like really like it um there's this like cute little ribbon moment that I like but this ribbon is not like inbuilt into the shirt it, you can take it off which I sort of don't like because um I sort of have this fear that I would like lose this now for the corset I just wanted something to elevate again any simple look um this look mm -hmm. is like still fine by itself but I wanted this corset moment to one because um the Luna uh, butterfly music video and plus I think it looks very cute. Like I said before like I'm already really skinny so it's not like I want that hourglass figure it's just because I want more for styling purposes. When I first got this corset it did not fit on me. If you're um, as skinny as me it probably won't fit on you as well. Um, my mom had to tailor it to um, make it fit on me because I wanted to be somewhat tight not super tight but just tight enough to give it that sort of shape. Now in terms of the pants, I really like the pants because I really dislike wearing jeans so I try to find anything that's like not um, like denim. The only problem I have with this pants is that maybe it's not true to its size because normally because I'm very skinny and I'm not exactly like insanely tall or anything, I would have a hard time finding pants that would fit me. Now I got the smallest size of this pants thinking it would be like the best option for me but it turns out it's not really because I find it to be quite tight which is again really surprising because I'm like very skinny. It does rise up a little bit for me so like if I do like crouch or you know get down or whatever you can see like it doesn't actually go all the way to the ankle or anything and so I mean maybe it's part of the style and maybe that's what you're into but for me sometimes I just want it to be down at the ankle because this is supposed to be like a high um, waisted pants I believe so you're supposed to pull it up quite high and so I don't really like that there's this much space in between but hey if you're into that um, go for it. In terms of quality it feels very nice I really like it. it's comfortable apart from it being very tight um, but I do like the feel of it and all. It is a little bit stretchy so there is some movement and freedom if you do get like the long size it's not too bad but yeah I wish I've got like a size up and I might do that soon. So yeah the only thing I really have is like just the sizing but you know next time if I ever do buy these pants I'll probably go a size up. Now normally I would put all these pieces together but these were my last three items that I wanted to show so I just wanted to like cram it all together at once. I'll start off with the top first and this is something I just wanted because it was like a basic shirt. Um, it fits very nicely even though I'm quite skinny it does you know fit very well. 
well and I think the quality is pretty good so there's nothing really much to say about it. Um, in terms of the skirt, I think the skirt is, um, it gives off a very perky look. The skirt is nice, it is elastic, it's stretchy so it's sort of like, um, it fits well with pretty much all shapes and sizes. When it comes to pants and skirts, I actually have a really hard time finding something that fits me for some reason. Um, again, maybe it's because I'm really skinny, but like things don't really uh, fit well with it like try to do like a high waisted moment or whatever but this being that it's elastic it does fit quite well so I like it a lot now as for the high heels I really like them the only problem I have with that is like it doesn't really like um, fit perfectly like I really wanted something that like really hugs at your legs and is very tight and all but it does have like a, some space in between so it looks a little weird or not too bad but like it's not, it's not perfect. I think the next time I go to a bar or a club, I do want to wear these high heels to, you know, give me this sort of sexy look, you know, get some boys staring at me or something. Also, when I first got the shoes, it did come with that weird smell and it actually still smells quite weird. But I'm sure it's like if I went outside in the sun or whatever, it would like dissipate. The smell reminds me of those like Asian or Chinese herbal medicine stores. It's like, yeah, it just smells like those Chinese essences and those Chinese herbs and all. It's not the most pleasant of smell, but yeah, it's not like anyone's really gonna be getting down and smelling your shoes or anything, so it's not too bad, and I'm sure you will dissipate if you like go out in the sun or whatever. I also think it's pretty good for the price, it's like $35 in Australia. I've been trying to find this sort of style on other places, like Fashion Nova or whatever, and usually they sell for like at least around $50 Australian. Um, so, you know, for the price, it's actually, you know, I'm happy with that. So those are all the stuff I bought from Yesdal. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is obviously not something I normally do. It's something sort of new. This is obviously going to be more for the people that are into fashion or makeup or whatever. I feel like being that my audience is very much LGBT and a lot of girls. Obviously, there's still those straight guys that watch me. But, you know, I feel like you guys do enjoy like fashion, skincare. Uh, makeup and all that stuff so you know I do want to just have fun and do whatever I want because why not it's my channel so yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you guys want to see more of this um, I know maybe my lighting was a little scuffed or whatever but you know I'm not really that much of a professional though I do try my best but yeah let me know if you guys want to see more Yes Style videos because I can definitely do that I really do like you know buying stuff from Yes Style I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and I hope you guys have a wonderful day bye bye thanks for watching